like to go over a line I showed in Melodic Motion Etude number 41 that has some interesting modulations and approaches to first inversion dominant chords. If you haven't done so yet, please do subscribe, like, share, and leave a comment. If you'd like to make a donation, there's a PayPal link in the description. I thank you very much just even for watching, maybe sharing these with people that you know that might be interested. So we're going to be here F sharp minor. This is just a tenth at the 14th fret of the 6th and 2nd strings, F sharp and A. We're going to have a melodic line that's just going to weave a little sequence. Just that line is going to be in the top. We're going to harmonize it with a bass line. And what's nice about this is that a lot of these shapes are going to be the same. So here we have 14 and 14, walking down to 13 on the third string. So this is F sharp minor down to B, basically B7 over D sharp reaching up from 11 and 11 to 14. And now here's an E tenth, 12 and 13, E and G sharp. And we're walking down to 11, F sharp, and now a C sharp minor, nine and nine, C sharp and E. So first part. A lot of these are going to be duplications. Now at 11 and 11, D sharp minor, walking down from, this is D sharp and F sharp, here's E passing, here's 8 and 8, this is G sharp 7 over B sharp, and now we're going to shift into another of these very similar straight across shapes. 11, not 8, and now 9. So this is going from C sharp minor, 9 and 9, C sharp and E. Here's a D sharp underneath. F sharp, 7 over A sharp. A sharp and C sharp here. immediately, very similar to the opening couple of chords. Here's B minor, 7 and 7, B and D, with a C sharp underneath, G sharp and B, 4 and 4, reaching up to 7. So 7 and 7, 6, 4 and 4, reach up to 7, and now A major. Our A tenth, A and C sharp, frets five and six on strings six and three. Even if you just took that much. And just got used to moving it. There's a great benefit in it you'll start to see more of the board at one time and making these connections. So A tenth, five and six, A and C sharp, down to B, F sharp minor, two and two, F sharp and A. Now our final, we got G sharp minor, so four and four, G sharp and B, walking down to A, and now, Unusual C sharp seven with an E sharp in the bass. That really is E sharp, folks. So one and one. We're gonna reach up to the B note here on the third string, fourth fret. And because of where we are string-wise and fret-wise, we're gonna have two and two F sharp minor with a F sharp and A and G sharp underneath. 
and we can resolve to first inversion F sharp minor over A. This is five and four on the sixth and fourth strings. once you get the hang of the, the shapes and how, how the bass line's moving. More or less in thirds, dropping down a third, back up, down a third. So I hope this has been of interest to you, something that you can use and try. This is, I'll put a link to it, it's based on the melodic motion etude number 41 but that has no talking. I thought I would take a little time to explain what's going on and point out some things. So I hope this has been somewhat helpful. Hope you're enjoying your playing and I wish you a very good day.